those looking for a luxury SUV are well catered for with the latest generations of the Audi Q7 and the Volvo XC90 both bringing fresh offerings to the market and competing with the Range Rover Sport for dominance in that sector. The new Q7 and XC90 also made available for the first time modules and hybrid powertrain, a path well trodden by Lexus. As not to get left behind. Lexus has refreshed its RX and here we have the fourth generation SUV, available with two engine options, the 3.5-liter V6 petrol hybrid, also known as the RX 450H, new to the lineup a turbocharged 2.0-liter petrol engine, the RX 200T. There are also five trims to choose from with the entry-level S trim only available with the RX 200T while the SE and Premier specs can only be had with the RX 450h. The RX 200 ES trim is certainly well equipped and includes adaptive cruise control, heated and electrically adjustable front seats, sat-nav, reversing camera, DAB and Bluetooth connectivity all as standard. Opt for the hybrid RX 450h SE model, and you will get a leather upholstery dual zone climate control and an electrically adjustable steering wheel added to the package. Luxury trimmed RX models gets Lexus's premium navigation system, a wireless smartphone charger and 20 alloys, while the F Sport spec includes a number of sporty touches, such as lightened alloy wheels, sports tuned suspension, a body kit and sports seats. The range topping Premier models get adaptive suspension, blind spot monitor and emergency braking, 360 degree camera and a 15 speaker Mark Levinson speaker system. Of the two powertrains on offer many will be tempted by the low CEO2 figures of the RX 450H, and the savings they bring to those burdened with benefit income taxation. However, with the hybrid model costing in excess of £48,000 there is a cheaper way of getting behind the wheel of Lexus's upmarket SUV. Step forward the RX 200T. Gone as the 3.5-liter V6 is fitted to the RX 450H, here replaced by a 2.0-liter turbocharged 4-pot as seen in the smaller NX 200T, IS 200T saloon and RC 200T coupe. If you can do without four-wheel drive, you'll save yourself £7,000 over an entry-level RX 450h. Considering that it already undercuts rivals and offers generous levels of standard kit, it seems like a good value for this kind of vehicle. Yes, 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 yes.